we are also going to focus, yes, on the fourth industrial revolution, get into blockchain in the most meaningful way, the internet of things. And uh, they spoke extremely well. What they were saying was both moving, it was engaging, it was touching, very touching. Somebody was watching it online, on stream, overseas send me a message on my cell phone and say this is most touching it was also informative because i think many of us will have learned a lot from blockchain to cryptocurrency to all those things most most uh, informative author and amongst various other enterprises he is developing the first black owned cryptocurrency platform he is a highly qualified blockchain expert Yet, his passion lies in social issues and the upliftment of African citizens. My name is Mpo Dagada and I am the author of the best-selling book, Mr. Bitcoin. I'm a blockchain specialist and have spearheaded the blockchain technology revolution in South Africa and on the African continent. Blockchain technology is an emerging space in the world with a PwC report saying that 84% of companies in South Africa and globally are looking to implement blockchain technology. Now for those who may be wondering what is blockchain technology, let me paint this picture for you. In about 10 years time, my self-driving car will be driving on the road and will ask your self-driving car to give it way so that it may overtake because I'm in a hurry. My self-driving car will be able, after doing that process, to tip your self-driving car by sending it 10 Rand on a blockchain system. This is the world that we're gearing ourselves for. The Internet of Things, powered by blockchain technology. It is very near before us. The world is more interconnected than it's ever been before. Global markets are all looking at making payments simpler and easier to access. They're looking at making machinery communicate with one another for reflective produce. South Africa, through the Reserve Bank and many stakeholders, has been very active and progressive within the digital space, having machinery working with artificial intelligence to better our systems. Now, it's no secret that the world becoming more digital is a threat to jobs. And that is why I commend our president because he has set forth a fourth industrial revolution commission, basically set to assist digital transformation in the country to ensure that the country is able to compete globally and thrive within the digital place. Our president has not taken a back seat when it comes to the digital revolution. He's actually chairing this important commission. We can't ignore the fact that the world is changing. We can't ignore that the biggest companies in the world are now digital companies. Your Facebooks, your Amazons, your Google. We too, as Africans, need to participate, dominate and rule in these sectors. Together, we move our country.